my channel so today I'm just going to be filming a what I got for Christmas video these are my favorite videos to watch on YouTube so I thought that I would just film one for myself um, before every video there's always a disclaimer that this is in no way trying to brag about what I got for Christmas I just love watching these videos so I thought that it would be fun to film one for myself so this year for Christmas I didn't really have anything on my wish list I only had one thing that I asked for from my husband and then other than that I really didn't have anything that I specifically wanted so, um, all of this stuff was just chosen by my family. And I didn't get a ton of presents, um, which is okay. I'm 24 years old. I don't need anything anyways. Um, but let's go ahead and get started. So, we'll start off with what Jamie got me. So, the, um, the one thing that I asked for this year was this necklace that I'm wearing. It's just a Kendra Scott necklace that I designed online and then I sent him the link and told him that I wanted and that was the only thing that I really asked for. I also asked him to build me a clock so in our dining room there's a blank wall and I just wanted him to build me like a big wooden wall clock so um, he is starting on that as well. Um, so those are the only two things that I specifically asked for. Um, all the rest of the stuff he got me was just his choice. So the next thing that Jamie got me for Christmas were these um, Adidas shoes. These I think are actually a uh, little girls, but they're the Adidas, what are they called? I'm not sure what kind these are, but they're just some bright pink Adidas tennis shoes. They're very bright and very out of my comfort zone um but i do love the color and the inside is really really like nice so he picked these out all by himself last year he got me a pair of tennis shoes as well and he did a really really good job um so yeah that was the first thing that he chose for me so the next thing that he got me was this um pullover it's just like a southern shirt company um sherpa really really soft brown pullover i am obsessed with pullovers like i have so many pullovers i probably could wear one every day it's like a, it's like one of the most comfortable things to throw on in the winter time it's just a pullover leggings and uggs so you can never have too many pullovers so i love this he also got me a certificate to go get a massage i have been dying for a massage i really really am in need of one so he bought me a certificate from a local spa to go get a massage so i was very very thankful about that moving on i'm going to show what my mother got me so the first thing that she got me was this really really soft green sweater it's like um i don't know what this is i don't know what this fabric is called but it's super soft it's super cozy and i actually wore it today to church and it was extremely comfortable and this is one of my favorite winter colors so i love that so the next thing was actually for me and jamie so she got us this down comforter um i have been wanting like a real down comforter for so long i had like a down alternative comforter and our dog actually ate a hole through it so i have been wanting another one so she got me this really nice down comforter so i was really really excited about that and to go with that she got us this white duvet cover set this is just a duvet cover with two shams and a decorative pillow um which i don't love the decorative pillow and she knew i wouldn't love it so she just said to like throw it away or i might actually buy a pillow case to go over it but yeah i love this and i'm so excited to put it on our bed and hope that our dog doesn't eat another hole through it so let's cross our fingers for that um lastly i'm going to show what my in-laws got me so i'm gonna start with these 
The first thing that I got were these Ugg. Um, these are the McKay boots and I absolutely love these. I have been looking at these for over a year, maybe when they first came out. So however long that's been. And I've been wanting them so bad. I just could not buy them for myself because I wouldn't know how much I would wear them. Um, but I did wear them today and they are just the perfect like casual boot that you can wear with jeans and they still look dressy enough to be like booties. So I really, really, really love these. The next thing that my mother-in-law got for me is this purse. This is a Prada handbag. Um, this was a total shock to me. I did not know that she was getting this for me, but I love it. I only have like two or three handbags. Like I'm not a huge handbag person, um, but I have just like a, my big Louis Vuitton, my small like crossbody, and then like another Michael Kors tote. So, but I don't have any that look like this. So I was really, really, really excited and I was really, really surprised that she um, got this for me and that she picked it out all on her own. And I love it so much because I'm kind of picky when it comes to handbags. I would rather just pick it out myself, but I was pleasantly surprised with how good of a job she did. So I'm really, really excited to um, carry this around. And the last thing that I got from my in-laws, um, mainly this is from my father-in-law, is a new handgun. This is the, um, I wanna know the technical term. The Smith & Weston m and 9 Shield. I don't know, I don't know, but um, I already have one and I keep it in my car or my nightstand, whichever one, but I'm home alone so much because Jamie works nights. I wanted one for my nightstand and one to keep in my purse so I didn't have to like transfer it back and forth. So they just got me this one. Um, it's just a small handgun, but I really, really like it. Um, it has like the laser on it and you can't tell, but it like has the laser built into it and everything. Out of all my presents, this one was probably my most exciting present. Um, I don't know why, I just really was excited to get another one so that I wouldn't have to transfer it back and forth and not know where it is and all that. Um, plus, I never said this on here because I don't like to bring attention to myself in any way, but I had like a situation in a grocery store about a month ago um, where a man was like, stalking me and like following me um i'm not gonna get really deep into it but it it was the scariest moment of my life and i didn't have my gun on me because it was in my nightstand um so yeah i was really glad to get that so that i can have like one in my handbag and one in my nightstand and then lastly this is not like a big present or anything but i did not know that i was getting this I have a four-year-old nephew, his name is Jace, and he is the light of my life. I'm obsessed with him, we're best friends, I just love him with everything in me. And he surprised me with this painting. Um, I guess his mom took him and had a painting made, I don't know, but um, it's Peacock and he made this for me and this was my Christmas present that he like chose for me and I was so like this is the best gift I was so excited about this gift it's so cute so I need to find a cute way to display this um somewhere at my house but this was my um gift for my nephew so that is it that is everything that i got for christmas i didn't get a ton of stuff which i'm glad i didn't need a ton of stuff but i love everything that i got and my family definitely knows me better than i thought they did and i'm very thankful and blessed to have such a great family and um, in-laws so yeah that is everything for today's video if you like this video please give it a thumbs up and subscribe i just passed 200 which i know doesn't seem like a lot but for me that is 
a new milestone every hundred to me is like the greatest thing ever so i would really appreciate it if you subscribe and let me know what you got for christmas in the comments below but thank you so much again for watching this video i will see you guys next time bye guys Thank you.